Is it time to buy or sell Google stock? In this video, we're diving deep into Google. Our initial report was published on our website on Friday, May 12, 2023, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Boost your experience by joining our YouTube membership. Choose the supporter tier to show your appreciation with a loyalty badge or the trader tier to request video analysis of the company of your choice. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since March 15, 2023, our system has ranked Google as a strong buy candidate, giving it a score of 7.47. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. Those who followed our analysis would have enjoyed an impressive gain of 22.27% since we first listed Google as a buy candidate 42 days ago. This translates to an average return of 0.53% per day since it was listed as strong by candidate. The stock has broken the wide and strong rising the short-term trend up and an even stronger rate of rising is indicated. For any reaction back there will now be support on the roof on the current trend broken at $117.12, a level that may pose a second chance to hit a runner. According to Fan Theory, $129.12 will be the next possible trend top level and thereby pose a resistance level that may not be broken at the first attempt. The current three-month trend suggests a potential 21.09% change over the next three months, with a possible return between 8.31% and 20.68%. As for the 12-month trend, it suggests a minus 12.20% change over the next 12 months, with a potential return between minus 44.01% and minus 12.20%. This translates to a price range of $65.79 to $103.17 after a year. Our latest daily update for Google includes the headline, Google stock price up 0.81% on Friday. The Google stock price gained 0.81% on the last trading day, Friday, May 12, 2023, rising from $116.57 to $117.51. It has now gained three days in a row. It will be exciting to see whether it manages to continue gaining or take a minor break for the next few days. During the last trading day the stock fluctuated 1.44% from a day low at $116.11 to a day high of $117.78. The price has risen in 6 of the last 10 days and is up by 9.47% over the past 2 weeks. Volume fell on the last day by minus 37 million shares and in total, 40 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $4.75 billion. You should take into consideration that falling volume on higher prices causes divergence and may be an early warning about possible changes over the next couple of days. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of stock was $122.43, and the lowest price was $83.34. Currently, the price is 4.02%, or $4.92, below the 52-week high, and 95.2%, or $2,331.41, below the all-time high on June 14, 2021, when the price reached $2,448.92. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets On Wednesday, February 8, 2023, Loop Capital Markets set a price target of 125. On Wednesday, February 8, 2023, Loop Capital Markets set a price target of 125. On Friday, February 3, 2023, Barclays set a price target of 160. On Friday, February 3, 2023, JP Morgan set a price target of 118. On Friday, February 3, 2023, Truist Financial set a price target of 120. Analysts have given Google stock a general buy rating. They rate the P.E. ratio as strong buy and price to book as strong buy. For return on investment, the analysts give the stock a neutral rating. The following signals have been identified for Google. Mostly positive signals in the chart today. 
The Google stock holds by signals from both short and long-term moving averages giving a positive forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general buy signal from the relation between the two signals where the short-term average is above the long-term average. On corrections down, there will be some support from the lines at $110.17 and $106.07. A breakdown below any of these levels will issue sell signals. A buy signal was issued from a pivot bottom point on Wednesday, April 26, 2023, and so far it has risen 13.31%. Further rise is indicated until a new top pivot has been found. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence MACD. Volume fell during the last trading day despite gaining prices. This causes a divergence between volume and price and it may be an early warning. The stock should be watched closely. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, by signal. Pivots, by signal 13 days ago. Bollinger, by signal 1 day ago. Short term moving average, by signal 6 days ago. Long term moving average, by signal 43 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. By signal 40 days ago. If we look at the 12 month chart we see. Short moving average, by signal 6 days ago. The long term moving average, by signal 43 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. By signal 41 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for Google Google finds support from accumulated volume at $116.57 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This stock has average movements during the day and with good trading volume, the risk is considered to be medium. During the last day, the stock moved $1.67 between high and low, or 1.44%. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 2.91%. Before we dive into the possible good trading levels for Google, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, the price-to-earnings ratio, or P-E ratio. This crucial ratio measures a company's current share price relative to its per-share earnings. A relatively low P-E ratio could signal a low expectation for the future of the company or that the stock is undervalued, indicating a potential buying opportunity. In other news, the next earnings report for Q2 2023 is expected on July 24, 2023. Analysts' consensus estimates are at $1.22. Keep an eye on these numbers, as they can greatly impact stock prices. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for Google. There's no significant resistance from accumulated volume above, which means the stock could move upward swiftly under the right conditions. In this case, you might want to enter a position and use volume to determine when to exit. On the downside, Google encounters its first support level at $116.57. If this support level holds, it could be a good entry point, anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for Google from multiple analyst sources is buy. Let's take a look at some recent insider trades. The five most recent insider trades were executed by GV2019 GP, LLC, who bought and sold 536,033 shares or options in the company. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be positive with a ratio of 34.879. Overall, insiders purchased 2,372,812 shares and sold 1,138,250 shares in the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is set at $113.98, minus 3%. This stock has medium daily movements and this gives medium risk. There is a buy signal from a pivot bottom found 12 days ago. Is Google stock a good buy? Google holds several positive signals and has broken the strong rising trend up. As the stock is also in great technical shape we, therefore, 
consider it to be a good choice at these current levels and we are expecting further gains during the next three months. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is overvalued. For trading on Monday, May 15th, we expect Google to open down $0.377 and start trading at $117.13. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information, you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.